year 2021 is going to end and by the end of this year we all know being as a tech lover a tech geek that android 12 stable role has been released out in pixel 6 pro and many devices for upcoming two to three months there will be most possibility to get android 12 in most of the devices around you hey welcome guys this is linux Knox, and in this video we are going to review pixel 6 pro port room ported for redmi note 7 which is based on android 12 with its latest features so without wasting much time let's have a look on android 12 so here's the home screen of android 12 port room for uh, redmi note 7 and here as you can see the icons are themed and the icon status bar has also been themed so well this android 12 update has given a new feature a new ui to the android world as you all know that the previous android versions were not as much as good and smooth but this update is a game changer in android world let's have a look in wallpapers and style of this ui so here uh, you can see the themed icon option is there using which you can theme your google icons and uh, there is option for dark theme here you can switch between dark and light theme very easily by accessing it you will get a set of pre-installed wallpapers inside this room as you can see these are the default wallpapers now let's have a look on uh, the widget of this room as you can see the and with android 12 there are many new clock widgets well it's a pixel port so you will get all the features of pixel room I am using this ROM in a 3GB RAM and 32GB variant and as you can see it is working so well and smooth. Let's have a look on the settings panel of this ROM. Uh, let's see the what kernel they provided. So here is the latest version of a kernel that is a predator storm 4.10. It is the best kernel for uh, Redmi Note 7 devices for battery backup and also for good gaming. And here is the beautiful Android uh, clock of uh, Android 12. So if you make it uh, 12 on this clock, so it will show the Android version here, as you can see. I will leave all the links in the description from where you can download this port. And uh, also uh, I will tell you how to install this uh, ROM in your Redmi Note 7 device. Also the developers of this ROM have added the Xiaomi parts uh, panel here. As you can see it uh, allows you to change the behavior of your phone according to your options. Now let's have a look on how to install this ROM in uh, Redmi Note 7 using Orange Fox recovery. You will be required some files like uh, firmware, the port ROM and if you want to root, the, root your device then you can root it also. I will leave all the links in the description so you can check it out and download it from there. And this is the interface of uh, home page of Orange Fox Recovery from where we have to flash our ROM. So after coming to this home screen, make sure you have taken all the files in the SD card or external pen drive because the internal memory will get uh, erased by this process. From the below option you have to go into wipe and select all this option make sure you have leave internal storage usb and micro sd so it won't get for formatted after selecting you have to simply click on swipe to wipe after completing the wiping process you have to simply flash the firmware of the room that is miui stock firmware 
then you have to click on swipe to wipe after selecting the file after you get done with the flashing or process of uh, firmware then you have to select this rom file and simply click on uh, swipe to wipe so the rom flashing will be started so after the installation get done it will show the message like this now again you have to come on home screen so you will find a manage partition option here so click on manage partition now after entering manage partition you have to uh, find data here now you have to select data option then after selecting data you will find option for format data here so you have to select format data and now you have to type yes here and proceed now after formatting your data you have to come on home screen again and now here you will find a reboot option so simply click on reboot now you have to reboot on system so this will uh, allow you to reboot your uh, report room so that's all for this video guys uh, if your room will not uh, start then you have to force reboot it by pressing power key uh, and holding it for some time please like share and subscribe linux knox if you liked our content Thank you.